Shalom. First and foremost, I want to give all honor, praise, and glory to Yahweh Bahashem, Yahweh Shai, Bahashem Rakakwadash. Double honor to our apostles and elders of Great Millstone and Ruth Well. Peace and salutations to the whole flip, pushing this true doctrine. Recall the four winds of earth and all truth and its sincerity. I'm the mind of Riyadh from the Mississippi camp. Lord willing, this will be a edifying lesson. And it's just a quick lesson going into, uh, you know, how when these people sell out, man, they, they have to keep their mouths closed, you know. And they have slip-ups when, you know, they they show that they don't supposed to be talking about nothing because particular subjects come up, you know, they, they, they try to veer away from it, you know. And this is what uh, Kevin Hart did. But I forget the chick he talking to. It might be that chick. Is it Kelly Clarkson or something? I can't remember. Whoever she is. Anyway, I'm going to play this video at the end. I'm going to do a couple of, break out a couple of scriptures real quick. And like I say, Lord, wouldn't be edified. But, you know, uh, these people, man, they especially when it comes to the nation of Israel, they'll sell out for these, uh, these little particular spots in this in devil's world. You know, and, and they can't speak on true realities of what's really going on behind these closed doors, man. You got some people who will come out and say certain things or they have come out and say certain things. And they're either put to death, they're stripped of their, their monies, they're locked up or something. It'd be, it'd be some kind of repercussions when they speak against or regarding what goes on within this... Uh, uh, society of wickedness if you will when they are giving these particular perks platforms and statuses okay so this is the book of mark chapter 9 so like in chapter 8 starting verse 35 for who will, for whosoever will save his life shall lose it but whosoever shall lose his life for my name's sake so like it for my sake and the gospels, the name, the same shall save it. Let me read that again. This is the book of Mark, chapter 8, verse 35. For whosoever will save his life shall lose it, but whosoever shall lose his life for my sake, and the gospels, the same shall save it. Right, so if you're doing this work, man, through the spirit of your heart, by me out shot, you know, hey, the Lord gonna protect us, man. He's gonna have a hedge over us. He's gonna preserve us, man, as long as you're sincere and doing it in all truth and necessary okay but but if you trying to get out of the curses by selling your soul selling out you know doing all kind of wicked abominable acts to have a particular status or position in this world hey you're gonna ultimately, ultimately be destroyed okay verse 36 for what shall it profit a man if he shall gain the whole world and lose his own soul so what does it really profit to sell your soul, man, to to pretty much destroy your your um, your spirit, okay? To give in to wickedness just to have a few extra dollars or a little extra fame or live in a particular home or drive a particular car, you know, to be on TV. What does it really profit, man? Because you're you're a a a a you're a you're a, what the, I guess you would call a a, a uh, expensive slave because these devils give you a little more, but they require even more than they give. Okay, verse thirty-seven. Or what shall a man give in exchange for his soul? And what what are you gonna do for these these the tangible riches? These uh uh these these gifts of of vanity. What are you going to give, man? You're going to sacrifice a family member. You know, you're going to bend over. You're going to eat, drink blood. You're going to, you know, do just something completely wicked so these devils will lock you in, man. And you're going to have to continue to give, give, give because they're, they're greedy. And they are going to come to require more. And one sacrifice is going to end up being two sacrifices. And two sacrifices is going to be three sacrifices. And it's going to continue on, man. Until they just bleed you dry. When they use you up, you're through, man. This is the book of Isaiah chapter 58, verse 1. Cry aloud, spare not. Lift, lift up thy voice like a trumpet and show my people their transgressions 
and the house of Jacob that sin. And that's what the, the men of the Lord do, man, the Lord's prophets, man. We 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 speak and teach and prophesy to our people, man, through the spirit of Yahweh. We tell our people all the wicked things that this devil is uh um uh, entangled in that he does and for our people to stay away from and for our people to repent you know what i'm saying to get out uh uh turn from this world you know what I'm saying to leave this wickedness alone turn back to the heavenly father the son you know what I'm saying repent pray for forgiveness you know we're doing those things then through the spirit amongst other things man just preaching this gospel but a lot of our people don't want to listen man but you know hey the scriptures say two-thirds will be cut off and die you know you still got people you know, who who at this point in time see all this shit going on, still want to be goddamn rappers, man. Still want to be in these uh, uh, industries, man. Signed with labels and all this nonsense, man. But nobody want to turn back to the Heavenly Father and the Son. And then when you do get able to get it within this this demonic, satanic uh, 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 group, if, if you will, amongst these people, hey, you can't say shit. You can't spend your money the way you want to spend it. You can't be around who you want to be around. And you can't uh, 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 say what you want to say. Now, come when it comes to being around who you want to be around, hey, us men and the Lord, we be around particular people, family members, whatever, but that time is short, man. We prefer to be around the brethren, man. You know? So I just want to throw that out there. But it, it, it's, it's not... Uh, uh, it's, it's, it's not like, like something that... Is, is just made to be where you just can't be around nobody else in the world or whatever. But the scripture speaks on, really paraphrase, you make that time short, okay? But when you were dealing with this devil, man, you you are monitored and, and, and dictated on how you move, man, financially and socially, okay? So I'm going to play this quick video, and that'll be it, man. Lord Williams edified. Shalom. Shalom. Had this, but I've had people throw millions of dollars in my face to do something I didn't want to do. And what? Just you've been on. Yeah. Oh, they're in the room. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That was my way of kissing you. Like it's open time. Yeah. You want me to keep talking about? By all means, we can keep talking about anything. But, but don't do it. Yeah. Just, yeah. So it's, oh, of course. I don't know if you've had this, but I've had people throw millions of dollars in my face to do something I didn't want to do. And what? Just, you've been on yeah. Oh, they're in the room. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That was my way of kissing you. Like, it's open time. Yeah, you want me to keep talking about it? By all means, I see you keep talking about anything. But, <laughs> but don't do it. Yeah, just, it's, 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 oh, of course. I don't know if you've had this, but I've had people throw millions of dollars in my face to do something I didn't want to do. And...